Ladies and gentlemen, three five-minute rounds in the flyweight division. Introducing first, the fighter on my right, fighting out of the blue corner, a wrestling number two jiu-jitsu specialist, standing five foot nine inches tall. His official weight, 126.2 pounds. His record, three wins, only one defeat. Fighting out of Alliance MMA of Cincinnati, Ohio, Eric Mel. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. He is a grappling specialist, standing five foot six inches tall, 125.8 pounds. His record, undefeated, 4-0, fighting out of Chavez Dojo of Albuquerque, New Mexico. Ladies and gentlemen, the XFC Open Fighter Tryout winner, Joby Sanchez. Gary Copeland. Come here, guys. All right, listen up, fighters. Both the senior instructions in the back. Expect you to listen to my commands at all times. Have a clean, fair fight. Any questions out of you, Blue? How about you, Red? Let's touch them up and prepare to fight. Final instructions from our center referee, Mini Brock Lesnar, Gary Copeland. We are ready for three rounds of action at 125. Eric Mel, 3 and 1. Joby Sanchez, undefeated, 4 and 0. Oh. Who will get the strikes off early here? Sanchez, great hands, solid yeah. round kicks. Round one, you ready, Blue? Round one, you ready, Red? Let's fight. And we're underway. Speed, tenacity for Joby Sanchez. Now he's got to watch out for those strikes, got to close him down. That's one way to do it, look for an early takedown as he latches onto a single leg pack. Good balance by Sanchez there, showing he knows what he's doing to defend those takedowns. Comes from that extensive wrestling background he's had. Sanchez backed up against the cage. Mal trying to drop down for a single leg again. Overhook on that right arm from Joby Sanchez. Smart fight by Mel so far to close the gap. Make him do a lot of clinch work, trying to wear those punching muscles out a little bit. See if it works against a kid with a lot of wrestling experience though also. Getting off some left hands in their clinch here is Mal just uh, clipping Joby around the ear. Still overhooking that arm is Sanchez. Will he get taken down now? Defends the takedown, gets clipped with the right hand, a high knee, just glanced the eyebrows, and there's a cut to Eric Mal already inside the first minute and ten seconds. Oh. High left round, that's a switch up round he spoke about. He chewed on that shin bone. Sanchez looking composed. Mel already looking for the takedowns early in the round, but failing so far. Mel still dropping his right hand. He's gonna eat another one. Joby launches the right hand down the tube, and Mel again goes for a double leg takedown. Sanchez still won't go to canvas, tries to trip him down as Mel. They tie up right in front of our commentary position. Mel again getting a chance to work that left hand to the side of the head. Leaning right over our table, basically. The cage is getting pushed out. Still has Joby locked up against the cage. It is Mel. Joby with a palm heel against the chin here, just trying to push Mel off of him. Maybe look for some room to work that right knee. Onto the canvas, but back to his feet quickly. Sanchez, he tears with his right hand, and Mel returns a favor. Mel almost got him. He's using a ton of energy to try and get these takedowns. Jumping knee from Joby Sanchez. Mel now looks onto the back, standing. Look at the hand control. Nice job stripping those hands out of there. A little bit of blood over the right eye. Mel doesn't seem to be bothering him. He glances towards his corner. They're barking instructions. He gives him a nod and says, I'm okay. And Sanchez trying to keep that right elbow in tight so he can turn into it. Cut that arm between them. You can see him turning. Nice. Oh, and finally Mel gets a takedown. He's been seeking for the last three minutes. Elbows now from Mel to the hairline of Joby Sanchez. Look for a guillotine and Sanchez quickly got out of dodge. Back to center cage now. Under two minutes remaining in the first round. Sloppy shot there from Mel and Sanchez with a half of strikes. He's going to make him pay. Yeah, Mel's paying for that one.
good stoppage by Gary Copeland. Jeremy Sanchez brings the house down in Albuquerque. Slap in the canvas, he's pretty bummed out. Not a place you want to wake up. Nice job by Sanchez. Here's, here comes the takedown, gets stuffed, gets clipped there with the right hand. You know, the good thing about Sanchez, he's got very good balance. See how he's scrambling and punching at the same time. A grappling background's gonna give you that. Great base. Here it is again, stuffs it. Gets that quick right hand off, puts him on his rear end, and then time to go to work. It just kept coming. Dropping the hammer fist, then the elbows, and put Mel away. Remember, he used a lot of, lot of energy trying to get those takedowns. Mel got a little sloppy there, might have, might have been a little tired. After so many attempts at those takedowns, got himself in trouble. Got to convince people that you're going to box when you want to wrestle. Mel still in the hands of the doctors here in center of the cage. As Joby Sanchez put an absolute shellacking on him. <laughs> 